What up? What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Jess. And I just seen uh, Peter Bulwer going for a price that I did not mind paying. So we hopped on over to our farm account. We're going to go on ahead and purchase that bad boy. Yes, I know I got a lot of contracts. That's because I never played a game on this account. So all we do is just open packs on this account and take whatever good cards we get, sell them, and... Uh, you know, whenever we get good, co whenever we get a bunch of coins, and I had about 300k on this account until the BCA bundle came out, and then I just exploded with millions of coins worth of uh, pulls, and then I, you know, sold them, and then I transfer all my all my good golds that I pull on my main account, I transfer them over here, you know, and I sell them here, and then whenever a good player comes up that I want, we just go ahead and we purchase them here. So. 355k definitely do not mind paying that the average i think it's like 340 somewhere around there so not too mad at that so we're gonna go on ahead purchase him and welcome to the squadron peter bulwer we're gonna go ahead and take a look at his stats then we're gonna trade him over and then we're gonna compare him to Derek brooks who's the same overall so six foot four 94 acceleration 86 block shed 97 pursuit 90 hit power 92 play rec 85 tackle 86 speed 987 excuse me strength uh, so he has 82 agility, he has 90 awareness, 64 catching, 85 tackling, 88 jumping, really no type of offensive moves, spin jukes, anything like that. So when he catches the ball for interception, he's not going to be able to get away from too many people. Uh, 85 power move and 96 finesse move. This would make him one very good pass rusher. Uh, 97 pursuit, 92 play rec, uh, 70 man coverage. 74 zone coverage 88 injury 92 stamina and that's about it with 90 hit power so we're going to go on ahead we're going to trade him over we're going to do some editing so you guys can sit back relax don't even got to worry about me tra you know transferring over all you know adding him on the trade block and all that behind the scenes stuff sit back relax and uh we'll see you guys when we trade the card over all right welcome back and as you can see we went ahead and traded uh, Peter Bulwer from our farm account to our main account. We're going to go on ahead and add him to the starting lineup. Get some gameplay. See exactly how he plays. Uh, definitely feel like he's going to be more of a run stuffer than a coverage guy. Well, his coverage looks pretty good. You know, almost 80 on both. But, I mean, when you compare it to Derek Brooks, you know, he's so monstrous in coverage. Uh, we're actually going to do a quick comparison real quick. Let's go on ahead and add Bulwer. We're actually going to start Bulwer, so we're going to have a nice little Ravens uh, middle linebacker, left outside linebacker combo. All right, so now we're just going to go on ahead and uh, take a look at the two. So as you can see, Derek Brooks with more speed, less strength, same acceleration, more tackling for Derek Brooks, more play rec for Brooks, more block shed, less pursuit, more hit power. But, uh, you know, in, in my opinion, you take a look at Brooks. And he has, uh, where's his, uh, you know, 89 zone coverage. Phenomenal. Well, not close to 80, Mulligan. I said Bowie, close to 80 on both. Uh, almost halfway close to 80. Well, not halfway to 80 because that would be 40, but you know what I mean. <laughs> uh, close to 80 on zone coverage, but uh, 70 on man. And Brooks just completely dominates him zone coverage, plus 16 and uh, plus 10 when it comes to man coverage. But I definitely feel like uh, when it comes to uh, playing the run, you know, when you take a look at Bullwear, he's going to have 85 power move and 96 finesse move. That is downright disgusting. That, to me, is going to make him much more difficult to block than Brooks with a 71 power move and 82 finesse move. You know, 96 and 85 for Bullwear is just going to make him just... Uh, block shed more even though brooks has more of a block shed but peter bulware with his 86 block shed plus 96 finesse move and 85 power move and with uh 87 strength is definitely going to make him a monster in the run game so i'm definitely going to utilize bulware when it's running situations you know first down second downs and then when it's third downs if i'm gonna come out in a four or three or anything that has a left outside linebacker I'm definitely going to go on ahead and put Brooks there because he has better coverage. And we're going to try him out. You know, Peter Bowyer, six foot four, uh, definitely is going to be able to clog up some uh, some passing lanes, being that tall. Uh, let me see. What's his jumping looking like in uh, catching? We scroll up and we see 
64 catching really really bad <laughs> really 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 bad but that doesn't matter because my middle linebacker Clint, that I use for my budget squad literally has never dropped an interception no well I use him so that kind of counts but okay so 88 jumping six foot four I definitely feel like he's gonna be able to jump up bat some passes down for us definitely gonna drop some interceptions but I think this right here is a very solid one-two combo. Again, we're going to have Bullwear whenever uh, we're playing the run. First and second downs. Third down situations, if I come out in anything 4-3 or nickel, uh, Brooks will be on the field. And uh, definitely going ahead and try to have him, you know, utilize his, his amazing pass coverage. And uh, running situations, like I said, you know, third and short. You know second and one you know anything like that we're gonna leave bowler in there for the fact that he has really good power move amazing finesse move and really good block shed and strength and uh not so good coverage but whenever it's a coverage situation that's okay we'll just swap over to brooks and we'll be able to go on ahead and uh have somebody that is you know faster and more equipped to uh play passing uh you know lanes a little better so that right there is the end of the video, fellas. I have the last piece that I needed to get. Uh, we will be getting gameplay. I don't know how soon. I kind of want to wait till I get gameplay because I know they're going to drop a most fair Dez, a most fair Gronkowski, and those are the highest overall players at the position. Dez isn't highest overall, but he's top six. He'll actually be, uh, well, number three or number six, however you want to put it, because 93 will have him tied with Herman Moore, Torrey Holt, Andre Reed with 93 overall. So technically I could put him at number three or I could put him at number six, you know, so uh, Yeah, and then Gronkowski, I think there's a 93 94 Gronkowski most feared. He'll be a uh, Highest overall tight end as well, but this is what the defense is looking like as of now uh, Bowyer, uh, Ray Lewis and Porter gives us a really 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 good for the run uh, You know cuz Porter is a monster at block shed and uh, Bowyer with amazing finesse and power move and uh, block shed. And Ray Lewis is just a goon, but I, you know, I use my middle linebacker. But uh, yeah, that's what the squadron is looking like now. Again, not sure when gameplay is going to drop because I hate adding players in the midst of a season. I don't want to play four games and then be like, oh, we added a new player, you know. Um, so I'd much rather wait to be. Whenever I start a new season, I want to have all the new players. That way I can finish out that entire season. And then when the next season starts, if there's anybody new that I got, then, you know, you can see an entire season, not just three to four games or however much. But anyways, that's the end of the video, fellas. Peter Bowyer is now on the squadron. Uh, depending on when these most feared players drop, we're going ahead and get you guys gameplay. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Really look forward to seeing how good he is. And I'll let you guys know, you know, what, how my experience is with him. We're going to go on ahead and be signing out.